we want to find the components of the addition of the two vectors shown below. So let's call this vector vector u, and we'll call this vector vector v. Because both vectors have the initial point at the origin, with the point zero comma zero, and vector u has the terminal point at the point four comma two, and vector v has its terminal point at the point one comma negative four, we can write the component form of vector u where the x component would be positive four and the y component would be positive two. And then for vector v, the x component would be positive one and the y component would be negative four. To find the sum of two vectors, we add the x components and we add the y components. And matrix addition is commutative, meaning vector u plus vector v does equal vector v plus vector u. So it doesn't matter which of these we find, let's go ahead and find vector u plus vector v. So the sum of these two vectors would have an x component of four plus one and a y component of two plus negative four. So vector u plus vector v would have an x component of four plus one or five and a y component of two plus negative four or negative two. So this is the sum of the two vectors in component form. If we did want to express this sum using unit vector notation, we could also express the sum of these two vectors as five times the unit vector i minus two times the unit vector j. Now let's take a look at the sum of these two vectors on the coordinate plane. One way to show the sum of vector u and v would be to place the initial point of vector v at the terminal point of vector u. If we did that, it would look like this. And the vector that has this initial point at the initial point of vector u and its terminal point at the terminal point of vector v is the sum of the two vectors, in this case, vector u plus vector v, graphed here in black. So this would be the illustration of vector u plus vector v. Now if we take a look at vector v plus vector u, we would place the initial point of vector u at the terminal point of vector v. And notice if we do this, this would be vector u. The result is the same, showing that vector u plus vector v does equal vector v plus vector u. The sum of the two vectors is this vector here. Notice how the initial point is at the origin and the terminal point is at the point five comma negative two. I hope you found this helpful.